Hi, Lady Day. Hi, sister. Hi, Irene. Hi, Regina. Hey, Austin. Hi, Mr. Brand. Hello, Dream Sun Limit. Hello, hello, everybody. Hi, family. How are you doing today? Hi, sister. <laughs> hello, hello. Hi. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Lana! Lana, my love! How are you, sister? Lana finally done popped on. Greetings, everyone. Hello, hello. Hi, sister. Hi, Annie. Hey, sis. Welcome, 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 welcome. Hello, HR Guru. How are you, sister? How are you? I love you too, my love. Welcome, everybody. My name is Jazzy Jujubi. I am a multifunctional contemporary everyday mompreneur. I'm the CEO and the owner of JushayEssentials.com where I create and make all natural hair and body products. I am also the visionary of the Glam Tribe where we encourage, enlighten, and empower. I am also a licensed cosmetologist and also a licensed educator. And I am a lifestyle sculptor here on Periscope. So we talk about whatever we want on my Periscope. So I hope that by the time this periscope reaches you you all are in positive spirits i hope you are blessed happy hump day today is wednesday um um i'm well sister i am having some me myself and time me myself and i time on today um i came to my girlfriend's one of my best friend's salon and um actually i used to work here um two years ago um but i came here to get my hair done and um well i remember i was telling you guys that i can't do my hair because of my finger um, I don't well I hurt my finger when I was making my sugar scrub um right now well I have cotton around my ear so I'm getting a protein treatment you should get a protein treatment at least once a month so I'm getting a protein treatment right now and um, so that's what's getting done and we're gonna braid my hair down because uh, I have wigs that I want to make and due to the fact that I can't I hi sister and due to the fact that I can't braid my hair um, and I really can't even wash them. I can't even really do anything with them because my finger hurts so bad. Well, I took my medicine, so it kind of numbed the pain. Hi, Robert. How are you? Um, so, I'm going to tell you what it is. I just don't feel like doing my hair. That, uh, that That's just what it is. And I really don't trust a lot of people in my hair. I don't really trust anyone touching my hair. I'm very funny about that. But my girlfriend, Deshonda, takes care of me. And this is my road dog. Like... This is my road dog. You hear me? She's out right now. But this is my road dog, and she always makes sure she takes care of me. So, um, and I said to her, I said, I'm not doing my hair anymore. Um, I don't have to. You get what I'm saying? I don't have to, and I don't want to. And I feel it's important that I take some time out for myself and do something nice for me. Sit down in the chair and just get your hair done, you know? So, I mean, really what I'm doing is just getting my hair shampooed and um, getting this protein treatment, deep treating my hair, and... Um, getting my hair braided down so that when I put my wigs on I'm well how are you Robert um I wanted just to do something nice for myself and I want to do my hair I want to go get my nails done and I've been working I've been out in the street I've been grinding you know taking care of my kids my kids had doctor's appointments I've had doctor's appointments and I've just been so tired and I said today on Wednesday is always going to be the day that I pamper myself usually I like to do it on a Friday but hello mr. minister Robert L Burton jr. how are you um, yes they have so hi Jasmine how are you so what I want to do is I want to take the time out to say on Wednesday I'm gonna pamper myself. I'm gonna do something nice for me because what I do is I make sure I take care of everybody else, but I don't know when it's time to chill and take care of myself. So I'm saying that as whatever. So, um, yes, exactly. So, so I said, you know what? That's gonna be my message for today. You know, take time out for yourself. Take time out for yourself. Like I have a hard time. Um, I'm well because I have I have a, myself. I have a hard time for myself wanting to do nice things for myself, getting myself together, making myself smile, and taking care of the world. And you can't take care of anybody unless you take care of yourself. Because if you're not here, you are no good to anybody else. Does that make sense? So what I'm saying today is understanding. It's great for us to make sure we take care of everybody else but you need to stop and take care of yourself 
If you need a nap, take a nap. If you need to go buy yourself some lunch, go buy yourself some lunch. If you want to go out and spend $20, $40, $50 on yourself just to make yourself smile, do that. Stop feeling guilty. I am a person that feels very... Hi, Alicia. Hey, sis. I am a person... Hi, Haitian Phoenix. Hey, sister. I am a person that feels guilty. Like some of us who are parents in here. You'll start out and say, you know what? I'm going to go do something nice for myself. But you will end the day doing something for your children. When your kids are well taken care of, everything is lined up and taken care of for them. But you will feel guilty and say, nah, you know what? I know I could do this for myself, but I can do this for my kid. You need to get out of that spirit of not taking care of yourself. Get out of the spirit of not taking care of yourself. Because you are no good to anybody else if you are not good to yourself. You really cannot give a thousand. You cannot give a million to anybody else if you don't take care of yourself. I've been having headaches. We've been talking about this. Exactly. I've been talking about this for the past, what, two weeks now? I've been talking about my headaches. I've been talking about how I don't feel well. You know why I don't feel well? Why? Because I'm not eating properly. I don't eat enough because I work. Yes, yes. That's who I am. That's what I do. And I said that has to come to a complete halt. So, scheduling myself on a Wednesday, Wednesday is the day that I am not working. Wednesday is the day that I'm not going to work. Wednesday is the day that I'm going to take my time out to go out on a date for myself. Thank you so much. I'm going to go out on a date for myself. Even if I'm going to walk, take a walk around the track, even though if I'm going to take a walk out in the street or I'm going to go to the park and just enjoy the scenery and just to enjoy the beautiful earth just the beautiful just to say wow god created all this beautifulness for me to look at he's he's given me these beautiful eyes why can't i take out a day to enjoy all the beautiful things that god has created right exactly honey quality time is always honey is the always the best time for yourself you know um and today I've decided Wednesday is my pamper time. Yes, I enjoy looking at birds. I enjoy looking at the ground. I enjoy looking at the grass. I enjoy looking at beautiful flowers. I enjoy just looking at the sky. One thing that I love to do late at night, I love to sit by my window and open the window and either if I go on my porch, I love to look at the sky and I love to look at the moon and I love to look at the stars that right there is some type of peace for me that makes me feel good and then I sit there and I inhale and I exhale and I think about wow God you are something amazing yes yes you are something amazing you sat there and envisioned what you wanted the earth to look like or you thought about the galaxies you thought about the planets you thought about the stars you thought about the moon you thought about the sun you thought about all these things why is it that I can't sit here and take the time out to show love and respect for, for the moon that lights the sky at night. For the stars that light the sky at night. And how beautiful they set at night. Why can't I enjoy something that simple that you took time out to create? That most of us don't even appreciate. Stop for a moment. Just stop. Sit on your porch. Sit on a bench and close your eyes and think about the beautiful sounds that these beautiful these beautiful creatures are making for us that's peace that we choose to ignore and don't realize how beautiful our lives are yes sis oh my god sis that's me all day and people always ask me like yes like why are you always smiling what do you mean why I'm smiling do you not hear the birds outside? They're looking at me like I'm crazy. They think that I'm weird because I'm like, you don't hear just, I said, just stop for a second. Just close your eyes and just stop. Just don't move. Just listen to the birds. They're communicating. We may not understand what they're saying, but they're communicating with each other. You think the birds probably understand what we're saying? They don't even understand what, they're, what we're saying, but they see us, they acknowledge us, they acknowledge that we are cute creatures of this earth. We're creatures just like them. So really not exactly, Lorna. So literally, literally in all actuality, life is amazing. 
Life is pretty awesome. Yes. So I appreciate how amazing God is. And I appreciate the amazing things that he put on this earth. Like, don't you think about water? Like, wow, God created water. What he created out of? He created water. He created condensation. Like, wow. We're watching the fishes in the water moving back and forth in the water. They're able to breathe on the water, which we cannot. God made that happen. He gave them gills. We don't have that. How could you not find that fascinating? How could you not? How could you not think about a polar bear? In the dead of winter, he's warm. A penguin, they're warm. And if we were out there, we would be cold. He's giving them fur. Like, I mean, think about that. How actually is the women, the men stay back and they protect the eggs while the women go out and hunt for fish to bring back for their families. Like, I mean, I think about all these things and people may think like, really girl nah honey it's amazing girl amen Denny it's amazing just the little things I think about I enjoy to watch nature music um to listen to the nature sounds I'm in, I enjoyed going on Discovery Channel yes yes I think about the dandelions right the dandelions right where when you cut your grass two days later those dandelions sprout up out of nowhere and then you pick them up and you blow them. I like to blow them just because I can. How is it that most people can't even enjoy something as simple as that? Hey, boo. Hi. <laughs> Hold up. Did you walk? No. Girl, I was about to say. Right? Dandelions. Yeah, the dandelions. <laughs> Guys, say hi to my bestie. Say hi to Deshonda. Hello. That's my boo right there, boy. Who? Who? We're on Periscope. Oh. <laughs> Deshonda don't know about that yet. Because back then, back then when I was, we didn't have Periscope. We were just doing YouTube. Right? That's my boo. Oh, y'all going to learn Deshonda. Deshonda's going to start her own Periscope. I cannot wait till she start her own Periscope. She's going to start her own Periscope. So, introduce yourself. Yes, honey. Introduce yes, yourself. Yes, I am Deshonda Evans. A hairstylist here in Chesapeake, Virginia. Juju is the girl. <laughs> She's gonna start her own Periscope. She's amazing. She's amazing. Oh my God! Like, let me tell you something. She takes care of me. Yes, yeah, she does. Yes, yes, yes. So we look. So right now I have a. Does Shonda explain to them what's going on, sister? Juju is getting a protein treatment. Influence yes. Reconstructor. In my hair. And it's all hard. But I love it. <laughs> <laughs> What's your Instagram name? Um, Shonda Evans 04. Shonda Evans 04. S-H-O-N-D-A-E-V-A-N-S. Evans is Evan Shonda 04. Oh. Evan Shonda, E V A N S H. No. Two S's, right? E V A N S. Yep. S H O N D A. So E V A N S S H O N D A O 4. Shonda is the bomb. Doc. Yeah, you know she is, right? She's on my hair. So that's how you call it the parasol. Yep. I, need, I have to get her up to speed on Periscope. She yes, because I don't know nothing don't about know. that stuff, honey. <laughs> Look. <laughs> yes. Yeah. No problem, sis. And I am enjoying this, guys. Like, I am enjoying this. Y'all just don't know. I said, Deshaun, she will send me every month because I'm not washing my hair no more. For what? Why? Mm-mm. Pamper time. It's pamper time. So... This is what's gonna happen for me. I'm so excited right now. <laughs> so we're gonna braid down my hair. How am I gonna do it? I don't know. But I haven't decided how I'm going to do my hair because I wanted to put the faux locks in my hair. I really wanna do it. But the only thing about that is the fact that y'all know how funny I can be about how I wanna change my hair up 
like every other day. So I just can't see myself to sit there and literally have faux locks in my hair because I'll get bored. So what I said was, I said, I'll make me a couple of wigs, right? Because now my hair's gonna be braided, right? Woo, girl, I've got so many. So I wanna display, so I said I wanted to be my own little model. Other than having my mannequins, I'm gonna be my own model, you know? And this is how I'm gonna start it, where, you know, I have different hairstyles, different makeup looks to my look, and it'll be me. Why can't I model my own stuff? I mean, why not? I mean, why not, right? Why not? So that's what's gonna happen. But I just wanted to come on, guys, and say hi, and talk about the word for the day was, you know, our word was today was me, myself, and I, and doing something nice for yourself, you know, and pampering yourself. Like I said, if it's, if it's every week that you need to say, you know what? Let me take $10 out for myself. So at the end of the month, the money that I accumulate, $10, $20 I accumulate, at the end of the month, I can do something nice for myself, pamper myself, go get myself a facial, go, you know, go get my nails done, or get myself a nice pedicure, or something like that. Something nice for yourself. It's just the thought. Because you don't realize how much this is a stress reliever. When you go take care of yourself, this is a stress reliever. This right here will release so much energy out of your system. I mean negative energy out of your system when you take the time out to do something nice for yourself. Right? Right, Sharon? Something nice for yourself. So, at the end of the week, or think about every day when you go to work, right? Think about how much money you spend on garbage you don't even need. Are you sitting here telling me that you cannot prepare your lunch so that just so that you can save some money that you can put to the side to do for yourself? Impossible. You can't tell me that. You can do that. Is it a little bit more time consuming that maybe you got to take that little time out at night to put something to the side to say, you know what, I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat. I'm going to save some money. I would rather spend $10 on myself at home making something for myself, right, for every day to bring to work and then have money at the end of the week. Maybe say you probably accumulate spending maybe $40 at the end of the week on just food alone that you're buying outside. And you could take that saved money, put it to the side, and save it at the end of the month or bi-weekly to go do something nice for yourself, to pamper yourself, just to make yourself smile. Are you not worth it? You are worth every penny. Hi, sister, hi, Laverne. You are worth every penny. You are worth that time. And I'm telling, the, I'm telling you guys this because I'm speaking that to myself. And I'm not doing my hair no more. Because Deshaun is going to take care of my hair for me. Mm -hmm. So yes. I have to do it. You know, Because I don't want to. I have no time for that. And Deshaun, listen, Deshaun loves. You, you hear me? When I say loves what she does, that's why she would be the only person to touch my hair. But she's the bomb.com. And she's pampering me. She massaged my scalp and everything for me. Same thing I would do. She massaged my scalp and makes it feel good. Guys, check out my hair, child. My hair is growing. It's growing. And it feels nice. Oh. <laughs> so, I miss you too, sis. Guys, did I not come on yesterday? Oh, yeah, I came on yesterday morning. And I didn't come back on again. I was so tired. And I was going to come on last night. I really was. I was going to come on. It was like 3 o'clock in the morning. And you know what I started doing? I started playing bingo. That's what happened. I started to play bingo. And I got beside myself. And then I said, mm, should I come on? Nah, because I know if I came on, y'all would have been up with me. And some of y'all probably had to go to work, and then y'all would have been on with me. It has, Lorna. Look, Danielle, my sister. And I said, no. Danielle, you changed your name. Everyone comes before us. We are the last ones to do anything for ourselves. Amen. Juju, you're being... Sis, I am. Deshaun is taking care of me. Look, I'm going to make sure that she creates a periscope. You hear me? I'm going to make sure she creates a periscope, and y'all go and follow her. Y'all will fall in love with Deshaun. Do y'all hear me? Y'all will be addicted to her ass. <laughs> y'all get listen to me. Look, y'all will be addicted. Y'all like, you, I, because when I put y'all onto people, believe you me, you would just love. Deshonda is one of the most realist. I remember when at first, when I came, because I said, oh, I didn't think Deshonda was going to like me, right? Me and this woman click like that. You hear me? Just like that. When I got here, just like that. And we've been tight ever since. So when I ask you guys to, hello, Rebel, how are you? When I tell you guys to support someone, I mean it from the bottom of my heart. Like, I love this woman. Like, I love candy. That's how much I love her. So we're going to create a Periscope for her when we can break her a Periscope account. Yes. 
me. You know it. Look, cause I'm, I'm only going to introduce you guys to real people. You know, people who are loving, heartfelt, and just about their business. And Deshonda is somebody that y'all need to know. She is someone that y'all need to interact with. And someone who just spits knowledge, but gets you, you get your mind going, but in the right form. Make sense? So I will only introduce you to the best of the best. <laughs> It is what it is. So, um, we're going to finish doing my hair because I, like, I want to spend time with my friend because I haven't seen her. So, I want to spend time with her. I will email you says, I will tell you why I changed. Okay, sis, no problem. Oh, honey, yes. So, I'm going to make sure that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to get a chance. Can I talk to you? Um, you, you? Yes, you can, sis. We trust you to do. And I know she's, honey, she's bomb. So, <laughs> I'm going to create. I'm going to help her create the Periscope, and then once she does that and stuff, I will let y'all know so she can come on so that y'all can go and follow her. And I'm going to get her on Periscope so she can understand how to do this. And I know for a fact, Young Blood Juju, thank you. I'm like, I know, sisters. I know. I know. All right? So say bye to Deshonda. See you later. And y'all see her later, okay? <laughs> All right, Laverne. All right, baby. I will private scope you, okay, boo? All right, baby cakes. I'll see you guys later. Bye.